Greece is finally free of your influence. My, my, is that Alexios of Aiad, the eagle-bearer, messenger of Zeus, he who launched a thousand hearts? Alcibiades, I'm known by many names, but that last one sounds to be of your own making. My young friend Orchimethes here could use your legendary talents to woo the object of his desire. You would have my eternal gratitude. What's the job? Have you ever heard of Braxila? The name sounds familiar. Who is she? Who is she? A poet blessed by Apollo himself. She describes the gods as if they were her lovers. Her lyre is a legendary weapon wielded in her hands. I want to meet her, but talking to a goddess such as she? Terrifying. Oh, nonsense. Usually you give a woman some flowers, and she'll show you her flower. However, this is Praxila. She is not easily impressed. Of course. No ordinary flower will do. They need to be worthy of a goddess. 
I come to this coast every year for the poetry festival. Of all the beautiful blossoms, none match the scent and radiance of the coral rose. Fetch some, and all doors and legs shall open for you. I'll return with your flowers. I've heard enough. Please, if you are as skilled with sword and heart as Alcibiades says, you'll return to me with the coral rose. As a poet, it's best that I stay at camp while you do the hiking. You'd be an easy snack for wolves or bears. I'll return with the roses. <laughs> 